Dean, a frustrating afternoon. What are your thoughts? No, it's a disappointment, of course. We, we want to win our, our home games. It was, um, it was a game of few chances, I think. Credit to Birmingham, in fairness. I think they've, they've come here, particularly in that first half, to, to sit behind the ball, make it difficult. And I think a point would have been a good result for them where they are in the league. And um, ultimately, we've not been able to, to break them down. We've conceded from a set piece, which is disappointing, of course. We conceded from one at QPR the other night, so we've got to put that right. We've got to improve. I think we've had one cleared off the line just after half time, and you know that might open the game up a little bit. But while, they, while it was nil nil, we just weren't able to find a way to break them down, and um, it's a disappointment, as I say. Uh, now we have to roll our sleeves up and, and respond in the right way, which the players have done plenty of times already this season. As you said, we have had chances. Uh, is it just a bit of kind of quality, quality perhaps in that final third? Yes, it is. And it's not just the forward players, it's, it's moving the ball with a little bit more accuracy. Um, Sometimes we're a little bit rushed in, in, in them areas. I can remember a little one-two with Antoine and Chris and, and Antoine's in and it's just, just couldn't quite get in on goal. So we've had plenty of moments around the box without finding that bit of magic uh, on the day. And, you know, as I say, if you don't do that, you're not going to be able to score. And then what you do then is try and see it out and keep a clean sheet, which uh, we weren't able to do, as I say. So, you know, credit to, uh, to Birmingham. They're fighting for everything at the moment. And as I say, it's a disappointment, but we'll, we'll respond. We talked in the week about how competitive the championship is and regardless of whether you're at the top of the table or whether you're further down, every game's really tough. Spot on, I think we, we got on the right side of a result of QPR the other night and we were on the wrong end of one today. I think if you take away probably the, the three relegated Premier League teams, I don't think there's a lot in any game. I think maybe people are thinking we're, you know, we're playing Birmingham, I think they're 18th in the table, it's going to be a, a whitewash. It doesn't work like that. Certainly, you know, we, where we're at at the moment, we're fighting every, every game. Every game we're, is, is really competitive. And, and as I say, there's not a lot in, in every game and uh, we've just got to keep this run going in terms of digging results out until we can get some of our uh, players back in January and, and then we'll have a real push in that second half of the season. For now, we've just got to keep pushing, keep responding to, to uh, bumps in the road, which this is a hugely disappointing, but we have to respond. From a personal level, in terms of Sam Bell, he won't remember the result, but he'll certainly remember his debut. It's a great moment for for him and his family of course with, uh, with his dad playing for the club previously as well so um, no, a great moment for him he's, he's, he's trained along with a couple of the other under 23 lads uh, for the Thursday and Friday and he's just impressed us in training he's been very very good in, in his finishing and we just thought if he gets that one chance you never quite know we've seen it before in football it wasn't to be but no a great moment he should be very proud and he did look busy when he came on yeah, yeah he's works tirelessly and um, puts everything into his performance as I say he's a goal scorer he's got an incredible record through the, through the youth levels so now we're, uh, we've got some good youngsters within them under 23s and uh, as I say at the moment they're helping us out and um, you know, we'll see about who we can include on Wednesday and see where we go from there.